One million of the world's plant and animal species are on the brink of extinction. This according to a sweeping UN report. This is really a basically a call to action to be able to put a halt to that and start to reverse that. Joe Walston is an expert with the Wildlife Conservation Society. Walston says nature is in decline at a faster rate than it's ever been in the history of man, and man is to blame. Whereas we've long known certain animals like elephants are in danger of extinction, the UN report is far more comprehensive, essentially warning organisms that are our life support systems are in peril. The systemic loss of everything from all insects to fish to plants as well, and we can be at a food shortage. If we don't reverse um, biodiversity decline now, we're going to see our problems in our agriculture, our water, our food systems. The UN report puts it plainly. More than 40% of all amphibian species are threatened, along with almost 33% or a third of all reef-forming corals and more than a third of all marine mammals. It also details the five main drivers of species loss. Changes in land and sea use, direct exploitation of organisms, climate change, pollution, and invasive alien species. If governments can come together and say it is time to stop cutting down the forests of this world to be able to reduce our impacts through our choices of what we eat, uh, of what we spend, if we can choose to avoid using plastics, we choose to invest in local efforts. The comprehensive data was pulled together by scientists from all over the globe. Despite the bleak outlook, there's still time to reverse the decline of biodiversity, but it requires a massive effort and it needs to start right away. We actually have to do this right now. We have to turn it right now.